Yeah, Steve, this is the scene all around Dublin tonight. Large trees knocked over by powerful winds that blew through earlier this afternoon. Those in town we spoke with say that storm only lasted a few minutes, but all this cleanup will likely take weeks. It almost sounded like lightning the way the trees were breaking. From the sound of snapping tree limbs to the hum of utility crew chainsaws, a powerful windstorm blowing through Dublin this afternoon, leaving behind a trail of toppled trees and power lines. I've seen um, windows that are broken, roof, tiles, siding, a lot of trees. Many of those trees are on the Dublin school campus. The private high school out for summer break, but posting a group of campers for the week. Campus officials say thankfully everyone was inside when the storm hit and safely sheltered in a basement, listening to the wind whip outside. The sound of the trees letting go of the, you know, that and the big branches coming down was terrifying. Much of the damage centered around Route 101 and Dublin Road, where several large trees collapsed onto power lines. A car also crushed by falling limbs. The town fire chief says his crews are out surveying the damage. Still assessing, been on the phone with the state and uh, Eversource. Uh, they've got a lot of resources coming this way. A frightening few minutes for those in the path of that storm, but everyone grateful that despite so many trees falling on busy roads, no injuries have been reported. It's fine because nobody was hurt. Yeah. That would have been awful. And some roads in Dublin do remain closed here this evening. Tomorrow, the National Weather Service is expected to come to this region of the state to survey some of this damage and determine whether or not this storm may have been a tornado. Live in Dublin, Ross Ketchke, WMUR News 9.